<sighs> hey folks, send back to recording boring old PBR fourth generation battles. Um, no, I mean, those, I still enjoy doing PBR battles, it's just the black and white battles are so fun. They're like crack cocaine. Uh, anyway, sorry, um, don't do drugs, people. Uh, anyway, um, so my, my, uh, opponent has a, uh, mono bird team, or mono flying team, uh, with a Rayquaza thrown in there. I'm just hoping it doesn't use the Rayquaza. And so, um... The first three choices of Pokemon were uh, easy, you know, the Pokemon who can actually do a lot of damage to birds, and then the fourth choice was um, just Charizard over um, Gardevoir. Anyway, my opponent starts off with two Swellos, which is just, well, Swell, but decides to switch one of them out, which, again, is Swell for me. Um, gets off some Intimidating, uh, which is all well and good. Uh, and his other Swell uses Protect, so it's quite obviously a Guts, um, you know, Flame Orb, Swallow, but anyway, it doesn't matter because I'm gonna, I'm just using Discharge, and that is going to hit uh, the Staraptor, um, who got taken out in a single hit. Yeah, sucks for Staraptor, but it did cut my um, Steelix's attack, so it wasn't completely useless. Uh, anyway, uh, Steelix has to use Stone Edge against the only Swallow left on the field, uh, and I'm gonna have to switch. Um, and I should probably switch it out next turn since it doesn't have a high attack to begin with. Uh, yeah, so now my opponent switches out, it switches an Aerodactyl, uh, which is, you know, just funny. Um, and I go ahead and send in Lantern, who can do all manner of bad things to it. Um, Aerodactyl goes ahead and uses Crunch against my Tachikoma, which one hit KOs. Um, yeah, my Rotom is, you know, many things bulky, it is not. And, uh, Aerodactyl has amazing attack. Um, so anyway, Swellow goes ahead and uses Brave Bird. Um, I'm not sure why, I mean, had I left in Steelix, Steelix would have taken that Brave Bird much, you know, with much less damage, so kind of hilarious, and my opponent's just racking up some burn damage. Um, so Lantern's still at pretty decent HP, and I figure, you know, it can do, it'll, it can do Hydro Pump or anything uh, nice on the next turn. Uh, Aerodactyl goes ahead and uses Crunch on it. Um, but I'm figuring Lantern can survive, and it does, because Lantern is pretty darn bulky. Um, and then Swallow does return, uh, targeting Lantern, and uh, that will go ahead and take it out. I mean, you know, it's bulky, it's not invincible. Um, but, you know, this isn't the worst thing in the world, because uh, my Steelix is at full HP, and um, has uh, all manner of targets. Unfortunately, uh, his Stone Edge missed. Um, which, you know, I don't know why I used Stone Edge, that was a bad move, um, because I was targeting Aerodactyl. Um, I have Gyro Ball on this thing. Aerodactyl is one of the speediest Pokemon in the game, Steelix is one of the slowest, plus it's a stab move, plus it's super effective. So yeah. So anyway, uh, Brave Bird hits Charizard and takes it down to almost no HP, but more than zero, so I am able to get off an Air Slash, which finishes off Swallow the rest of the way. Um, and, yeah, um, so, uh, Charizard, not necessarily the easiest Pokemon to switch in, um, and especially, yeah, as you can see, uh, it has now died due to the Life Orb recoil damage, um, yeah, it's not the best, it's not the most bulky Pokemon, um, but it is what it is, um, yeah, as you can see, Gyro Ball one hit KOs Aerodactyl, Aerodactyl, not the bulkiest Pokemon, uh, and it is so freaking fast. Um, Steelix now, by the way, up to almost full HP thanks to some leftovers recovery, and now he's down to his last Swella. Um, I was thinking that he was going to go for a Protect, so I went ahead and used Curse. Um, I was not predicting a Double Team, because Double Team is banned from Civilized play. Um, you know, it's not just, it's just annoying, and it adds a, a further element of luck to a game that doesn't need any more luck in it. Um, but you know what? I don't care, because even if it gets as many uh, double teams as it wants, uh, and I miss as often as I want, I'm going to outstall it, because it's got that burn damage. In eight turns, it will be dead. Meanwhile, it can't do anything to me. Um, yeah, so my jar of ball misses. Whatevs. Again, I'm just going to stall this uh, guy out. Um, yeah, Swallow goes ahead and uses Facade, uh, which does nothing. I mean... Uh, if I just did nothing but sit on my butt, um, I would still have won this match. But luckily, my Gyro Ball does hit, and Swallow, not necessarily the bulkiest of Pokemon, goes down. So that is, as they say, that. 
and I have won the match. Um, and that was kind of fun. So anyway, uh, yeah, comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. And so long.